Right, well now, from selecting the right sunscreen to keeping your nails from going yellow from nail polish, Janine Morris, founder of BeautySweetSpot.com, is here to share a few summer beauty secrets. So welcome. So great to see Hi, you. Hi, Carolina. Hi. Okay, so let's get started now. Beach or pool, a good sunscreen is a must. We all know that. But is there really a waterproof sunscreen? Because I've seen them kind of say that before. There is no such thing as a waterproof sunscreen. Really? The FDA does not support it. So now what you're seeing on labels is the word water resistant. Oh. And I just okay. want to clear up what that means for everybody because it's a little confusing. Water resistant means that you have to reapply it every two hours if you're in the sun. But if you're in the water, reapply it every 40 minutes. That's oh, the wow. general rule of thumb. Okay. All these labels, like on this L'Oreal Advanced sun, um, sunscreen, it says water resistant. Mm -hmm. And a lot of them will say 80 minutes. But really, if you're in the water, be safe 40, every 40 minutes. Reapply, reapply, reapply. Right. And you know what? I think so many more people are really paying attention and taking care of their skin. You know, a bad sunburn. That can really affect you even later on in life. It only takes one bad sunburn to put you at risk for melanoma. Totally true. All right, well, now let's move on to nails. Nail polish can turn your nails yellow, but you say there's a secret to keeping them looking healthy. I, absolutely. Highly pigmented nail polish, like this color I'm wearing right now. Ooh, naughty. <laughs> I love it. Um, can turn your nails yellow. It stains it. And a okay. lot of the time it's from the formaldehyde or just from wearing highly pigmented shades over and over again. Okay. So, to, to get rid of the stain, you can soak your nails in a bowl of lemon juice. Just squeeze the lemon and just take a gentle toothbrush and scrub it off and that will remove the stain because lemons are a natural bleaching agent. Wait, but now do we put any water in it? It's just you lemon don't have juice. To. Nope, just the lemon okay. juice. Mm -hmm. And then what you want to do to keep your cuticles um, really smooth and moisturized is use cuticle oil afterwards um, just to make sure that they don't get dried out. That's so easy and everybody can do that at home. It's yeah. not like you have to go to the salon Simple to tip. do it. Okay, right. perfect. All right, now moving on. There, there's a myth and I don't know if you can tell me the truth or not, but does your hair grow faster in summer? It's a huge beauty myth and I'm going to reveal the truth right now. Debatable but it does. No way. It really does. And here's why. Because our estrogen levels rise because we're in the sunlight all the time and we have a healthier diet in the summer. Your hair can grow faster in the summer, but here's the drawback. Only about a millimeter. Oh, well now who's <laughs> Which keeping is like, track of that? So it really <laughs> doesn't. It, it does, but it doesn't. See, I was going to say, that's why people have that beachy hair, you know, but no, it no, doesn't really. It doesn't really. Right. It doesn't really. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Um, so, But you want to keep it healthy all summer long because you're facing chlorine, you're facing salt water, you're right. facing the sun, your hair's going to get dry in the summer. So if you want to keep it healthy, I suggest using a deep conditioner. I have ones here by Matrix, oil by Dove. There's all different kinds of deep conditioners or oils that you can use. Okay. You want to use them about twice a week in the summer. Healthy hair leads to longer hair. And you know what? These are actually at any drugstore and they're not expensive. They're not expensive. You can get one like this one by Aussie is Three Minute Miracle. Drugstore by Great. Totally great. Yeah. Okay, now let's move on. I've had friends who say they need to tan because it clears their acne. Is this true? This is the biggest beauty myth. Really? You cannot, if you have a face full of acne or even a pimple, the first thing people do in the summer is they want to run out into the sun and just stare at the sun. Right. It's all an illusion. Tanning does not clear acne. What happens is you create an illusion because the skin around your pimple gets darker. But what really happens is the sun dries out your skin, causing your skin to produce more oil, therefore more acne. So wow. it makes the problem worse. Oh, no, but Not, you have a solution, though, for yes, us. Yes. And plus, you're you're bringing yourself in at risk for melanoma. Of course. So it's horrible. I mean, you Don't stare at the sun if you have acne. Absolutely. The solution is create the same illusion with self-tanners for the face. Okay. And there's great options at the drugstore or at Sephora and elsewhere. Um, Claudalee makes one that's instant, and Jurgens makes the one that you can use every day, so it works over time. Oh, those are good, too, because then you can build on the tan as well. Exactly. Okay. And it will make, create the same illusion without the health hazards. Okay. Well, mm -hmm. now, you know, I'm an ethnic girl, and I've heard that hair, it grows back <laughs> thicker and darker after shaving, but you say that that's not the truth. It's not true. You're, okay. You, when you shave, you're cutting the hair at the root, right, and you're cutting the, sh the shaft straight across. So when you feel that prickle, it feels, it feels thicker, and it looks darker, but if we were to let our leg hair or arm hair grow out, uh -huh. we would notice that it's not any thicker or darker. We just don't give it the chance to grow out any further to notice that. Well, boys, guess who's not shaving her legs? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> but you say these razors are great and that they can help you maintain. Yes. Okay. You don't have to steal your boyfriend's razors. There's great <laughs> ones out there for females as well. Well, these are all great tips. Thank you so much for helping us look our best. Thanks, Thank Jenny you. Morris. We appreciate it.